Hi. All right. Let's just... Yep, I can throw at him. One, two. All right. Oh, he's one resistant. How many... No way! Dude! Could you... He's down! Oh, wow. He's down in the floor. Hey, how are you doing? I'm JJ and welcome back to Bendy and the Ink Machine. And today... Oh boy, guys, we're gonna have some fun because today we will check out really cool update to chapter number four. So guys, maybe you have heard that there was a hack made by my friend RTS where he could shoot bacon soup cans into other, well, basically uh, creatures. But today we can actually do everything by ourselves. There was an update and there was an easter egg added where you can actually get a bacon, I don't know, can we call it a minigun? But basically we can throw bacon soups and we can deal some really serious damage. So guys, let me show you everything. Let me show you how it works. So basically we need to hop into the Colossal Wonders, chapter number four, because this this is where everything is taking place. So by the way, if you haven't heard of RTS, my friend, he makes really awesome Bendy and the Ink Machine hacked episode. So I strongly recommend to check him out. So basically, Today, what we're gonna do, let me go really quickly and show you how you can get a bacon uh, weapon. That's right, yeah, I know, bacon soup can weapon. So basically, this is so crazy. So first of all, I'm gonna really go as fast as I can, basically make a speed run, how to complete chapter number four at a certain point where we can actually get that bacon soup minigun. So let's take this leverage, because without it we cannot progress any further. So now, first things first, guys, if you're hyped for Bendy and Link Machine, chapter five, which is gonna be uh, on Oct on October uh, 26, uh, released on October 26, then leave a like, because I'm definitely gonna make some videos and you're always welcome to subscribe to the channel. So basically, now there will be a small jump scare, <laughs> if you all don't know already. So basically, don't, get, don't be fooled, get your pants down or up, I don't care, and the jump scare in 3, 2, 1, bam. Don't worry, don't worry, this is how it's supposed to be. I'm gonna collect every single book. This is the last one. And now we can move forward. Now, I'm actually two minutes into the game and I'm already uh, with the new objective, Enter the Darkness. Wow, this is, this is so cool. So basically, what I'm trying to do here, I'm trying to quickly show you how you can get your bacon minigun soup can thing and enjoy it in your life. So basically, you can... It's not like um, a thing that you can only enjoy. You can actually go and defeat bosses with it. Like Bertie, you know that thing uh, who created the theme park? The dude who created the theme park. You can actually uh, basically dispose of him with the bacon soup mini gunnage. I, I, I'm actually so in, so hyped just because I never thought I can actually make an episode like this just because I'm not into that hacking so much. Um, RTS, he is really the man if you want to check the hackage thingy. Now, poop, thank you for the cogwheel. Thank you very much. So, wow, I'm making so much progress in like three minutes. This is so cool. So now, very fast, there will be two jump scares. Don't worry, I'm gonna uh, prepare you for everything if you don't know about them already. But wow, this game is so cool. By the way, it's actually October 1st, so 26, uh, 26 days, and we will get the final chapter, chapter number five for Bendy and the Ink Machine. So it's actually so cool. So don't worry, whenever we'll be in the middle, there will be another jump scare, but you just don't, don't, don't worry. Everything is coolish. I'm here with you, here. You think we're gonna drop? No, 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 no. Bendy has not other plans for us. <laughs> All right, so let's just go onto the other side and just because this is where we need to go and everything is cool i still have my hands even though i cannot see them now let's just get out of here thank you mr cart even though you are not a cart so basically uh jump scare number two will be in two seconds or maybe less now don't worry these hands we can shake them hello mr dude 
how are you doing um so basically if you don't know who they are these are the lost ones and they are well basically lost and now alice hello how you do so basically she's gonna ramble about some stuff about boris the wolf but we're gonna save him eventually don't worry but this episode is not about this this episode is about an awesome easter egg oh man this is gonna be so cool by the way um yes i am looking for my friend wolf boris now she's gonna talk for like 10 seconds more don't worry she's friendly at some point of the game now basically this is the last one hi how are you doing now let's open this one oh i know they look hideous and creepy but they are so cute at the same time that you want to hug them now guys are you prepared for the fifth jump scarage so this is where we are going to meet mr bendy and he's good don't worry he is actually a good boy bam thank you we're just gonna ignore him because um why not and let's go to the right i'm i basically know where we should go i think and now we should go to the right and uh yep everything should be all right so basically in like three minutes we will have our bacon mini soup gun whatever you want to call it and we will have some really awesome time with it by the way if you hear the banging that's the lost one who really wishes to lose his head anyway let's just move on through this event there will be no more jump scarages and uh, this is basically the end of this creepy little uh, event now let's go out and ooh. It lights up so beautifully. Come up and see me. So basically, um, it's actually so interesting who left this message. Was it Bertie? Uh, basically, the park designer, or was it Alice? Uh, but there's no Alice right here. There's this only. You see, this is the theme park. It looks awesome. Mitch. Now let's just use this one. Bada boom. And I'm not gonna turn on this tape just because it's gonna the Bertie is gonna ramble a lot about his theme park about the Joey Drew what kind of person he is if you haven't seen the episodes well basically normal let's play episodes I'm guess I'm gonna leave them in the video description you can check them out because this game is actually has so much awesome stuff it's just now guys basically right here we will need to complete two uh, mini games and then uh, we will be granted the access to the one and only place uh okay so let's just wait for henry to stop rambling and yep hang in there boris i, I know you're coming so basically you see these two are opening now we need to shoot uh at these obstacles and we cannot miss bam this one is good the second one is also cool so basically if you are struggling with this one just turn on the cross here as you can see i am doing it's a lot easier to finish this mini game bam 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 okay wow what an awesome is this gonna be a re yeah that's a record i got them all this is so cool now we need to finish this one for the next doors to open now and i need to bam yep three of them gone now and one two three oh okay one okay let's try and bam did we do it? I think we did, right? Yep, we did. That's awesome. We You don't need to throw all of them down. Now, just... You, you need to do... What you need to do is push this one. And now, guys, this is where the fun begins. We need to push one or more leverage down. And then we can access to the place where you will find yourselves. Or, well, basically, we will find ourselves... A really awesome new gun so basically this is research and design now guys if you don't know what you need to do here yeah weapon I know so basically what we oops okay this is <laughs> this is not going too well basically what I need is these bacon soup cans and with these bacon soup cans, we are going to distract the butcher gang. We can actually take this one too. So now I think I have four of them. And that's basically enough. Now, let's just wait for them to go into the same place. They're actually trying to warn themselves now. Good. Let's just run to the left side because this is where the first leverage, which you need to turn down, is located. By the way, you see? 
This is a bacon soup can. It's right here. I'm not touching it because you, uh, we're, we will remember about it uh, in like two seconds. Now we can actually just open these ones. Bada boom, bada bam, bada bam. That's two. This is what we need to do now. Um, now there is a second, third lever actually, and I'm, you know, I'm just gonna run. I know they're gonna chase me, but um, I, th I thought I think that this is like the best way to actually juke them so whenever you are going through that corridor because you need to go right there you can throw a bacon soup right here but it always does not work for me so i'm doing the second thing i'm waiting for them to go into this place and i'm gonna throw a bacon soup can over there and they're gonna be distracted and i'm gonna have the chance yeah up that's cool. That's good. That's good. I have. I will have the chance to go right here and just turn on the second leverage just right here. And this is it, guys. This is it. What I need to do right here. I just need to forget about these three because they're. I know they're awesome and cool. But uh, by the way, uh, we cannot dispose of them. I can actually throw the bacon soup at them how much I want. Now I can actually just take this one and I'm gonna show you that we, well, basically at this point, what you need to do, you can just go outside of here and that's it. Uh, like this, you can, you have a bacon soup in your hands, bacon soup can in your hands and you will gonna uh, drop it in like right here. Boom. And that's it. You think that you are good to go and you can uh, just turn on the second lever and which we're gonna do right now and move to the Bertie, uh, well, challenge, boss fight, whatever you wanna call it. But don't do that. Uh, instead, uh, what you wanna do, you want to go back into the same place and you want to go back into one very specific place where you will find yourself a bacon can soup just because you won't be able to distract them you see you need at least one more bacon soup can to distract these three so if you go all around this way you will see that there's a can and it is not highlighted but you can still take it just like so now don't drop it at any cost because this one uh, can will basically save your life now what we're gonna do we're gonna go down we're gonna distract distract these three with this bacon soup can just like so we're gonna throw it up over there now they're gonna be distracted yeah you go girl you go three and we have a clear passage to the bacon soup minigun by the way you remember i told you about this bacon soup it's gone i don't know why but that's okay because guys feast on this look how many bacon soup cans there is let's just count okay one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one two three four five six seven eight nine twenty nine bacon soup cans and these are not like ordinary bacon soup cans with these you can actually dispose of a butcher gang members now i'm just gonna show you i'm not i really don't want to waste them because you have only 29 of these and so let's just go and uh i'm gonna try and kill one let's just go out you can just run away and forget about them you see okay they're fast but uh okay let's boom you see one is down. I'm not gonna waste two more to kill uh, these two. Uh, four more bacon soup cans. But basically, this proves the point that you can actually dispose of them right now in the game. Isn't that cool? So right now, I have 27 bacon soup cans that I can throw, that I can actually use. And I think, well, I'm positive that you can use them on Bertie and you can use them, I think, on Projectionist. Uh, and that's actually so cool. I have... I'm gonna try and and do it. So basically, um, whenever fighting Bertie, uh, the theme park designer, there is one crucial thing. You, yeah, let's go here. Uh, attraction storage. You don't want to pick up the axe to finish off Bertie, just because you will lose every single bacon can that you have right now. So let's activate this uh, tape recorder because this is how you're supposed to go. And this is the new boss. Basically, you need to shoot the bacon soup cans. Wait a second. One cog is missing. What? Yeah, it's missing. This is so strange. You see, these have two and this one has only one. 
Is it supposed to be like this? So basically, um, okay, let's just leave it. So if you didn't know, uh, there is an axe right here in this table. So basically, um, Bertie will destroy the table at one point of the game and you can pick it up, but don't do it. Okay, so we will try and dispose of Bertie with the bacon soup can. So now he should open up and reveal his beautiful face at any point of the game. You see, he's coming to life. Alright, he's still here. That's great to know. You see, he's right here. Now, we need to wait. I'm just gonna show you how it's done with the bacon soup and I'm hoping I can actually, uh, well, basically, you know, dispose of him. Now, yep. Yeah, you see, there's an axe. Don't, don't go for an axe, okay? Don't, just don't. Okay, now you just go and, alright, he's still s moving and turning, which is, okay, I guess. Now, this is the chance. Guys, you see, these are highlighted. Bam. Boom. Oh my god, I just lost one and uh, two. Okay, that's it. You see, you can dispose of these cogs. I know, are, are these cogs? I don't care. With the bacon soup cans, which is actually crazy amazing. Okay, one, two more. Yeah, go down and uh, boop. One and boop. That's it. And how much do I have? I think I'm around 20. So uh, don't waste them on anything else. Just go for these arms. And you know what? Uh, it might take a little while. So I'm just gonna speed everything up and just finish. I hope I can actually finish this boss. And then we will go and try and meet the Mr. Projectionist. Let's just go. Let me show you how it's done, all right? For one time. Boom. And boom. Okay, he lost one arm. Bye-bye. Ow. Okay, I... He did not hit me in the butt. Okay, okay, let's that's that's okay. Let's just continue with the boss. All right, guys. So this is the moment of truth. There is only one single arm left, and can I do it in this run? I need to go to the other side. Oh no, I can. Maybe I can. Wait, maybe I still can. Oh, I need some time. Okay, no, <laughs> I can't. So basically, let's just. Okay. This is it. This is... Okay, he's covering that little other one. Oh, I lost. Missed. Okay, the last one. The last cog. Oh! No! Okay, so only one single cog remains right here. And this is gonna be our chance to dispose of it. He's covering it a little bit. Oh, no! That's it! We did it! Guys, we did it! We did dispose of Bertie with the bacon soup cans. This is so crazy and I still okay, it's just going all over the place. <laughs> Look at him. Oh man, he's so it's now closing and the door are these doors are now opening. So, I'm actually I was not keeping track of how many bacon soups I threw at him, but I missed a couple of shots, which is Okay, I guess, but now the moment of truth. So we're gonna go and try and confront the projectionist Norman Polk. Well, maybe he's not normal Pol Polk anymore. Um, I don't care. Anyway, uh, let's just go and check out uh, Mr. Projectionist. And is there a possible way? I don't know. I, I did not try. I tried to confront um, Mr. Theme uh, Park guy with uh, bacon soup. And well, basically it worked, but I stopped at this point and now this is completely new for me so let's just hit the three button three lever and let's go right here so basically choo 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 this is where the train will be and i don't know how many bacon soup cans i have but i'm gonna throw them at the projectionist he should be right here yes he's right here now guys let's let's go and check it out hey i'm gonna scare him hi all right, let's just... Yep, I can throw at him. One, two... All right. Oh, he's one resistant. How many... No way! Dude! Could you... He's down! Oh, wow. He's down in the floor and I cannot see him anymore. <laughs> anyway, this is so crazy. You can dispose of Mr. Projectionist. This is so crazy. What will happen if I go... And turn on the lever on the second floor because this is where the awesome animation where Bendy confronts uh, confronts him is taking place. So let's just pull this one. I don't know how, don't know how many bacon soup cans I still have, but we can actually just go and uh, 
check, I guess. So basically, the last lever is right here. And uh, will there will be like an animation where Bendy is actually ripping? Okay, it's dark. That's bad. And it's not dark anymore. Well, that's good. <laughs> Let's just go down. Hey, Mr. Mr. Projectionist, are we cool? Do we have like a coolage with you? No? I, I'm hoping we have. So basically, there should not be uh, a projectionist anymore. So what will happen? That's actually so interesting. Now, let's go down. And uh, we need to go right here, I believe. Yes, this is the exit. And he should start attacking us. Start screaming any second now. And he's not. This is it. This is how you avoid the projectionist. Oh, wow. This is... Okay, thank you. This is so cool. So, basically, uh, if you don't want to get jump scared by uh, the projectionist, you just need to dispose of him. And that's it. That's, that's the last lever. And the last lever will render uh, these doors open. And that's it. Right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> the main lever, of course, JG. Let's just pull it off, pull it down and rescue Boris. Now, wait a second. I still have some bacon soup cans left. So, we can actually go... Sit in this awesome cart. Okay. Thank you for scaring me. Now, let's just go and see. Can we... Can, should... Yeah, okay, thank you. And let's see. Can we kill the zombie pumped Boris with the bacon soup? That would be so cool. Okay, so I don't have bacon soups in my... Okay. Of course. <laughs> I don't seem to have a bacon soup can in my arm right now, but uh, I'm still guessing I have it. Oh, thank you for for the ink drops. Now, okay, you see that's Boris. You know what? Let's just for fast forward everything and uh, check the fight with Boris and myself. All right, guys. So we are in the final room of the game, where the final boss fight will commence, and I'm hoping. That we have that bacon soup can machine gun mini gum mini gum <laughs> in our hands and everything is gonna be cool. So now if whenever we go through these doors, Mr. Boris will just pop on through us into the air and the fight will start. So guys, are we ready? I'm hoping that I have enough bacon soup cans left. I don't know how much and um, basically 29 I wasted two at the start killing the the, uh, the butcher gang member but um okay hi you look crazy but I like you I'm gonna hug you later okay so now the moment of truth yep we s guys no way we still have the bacon so and he's charging okay so shoot what should I do yeah all right that's that's okay I'm gonna throw it no! No? No way. Okay, so... Do I need to... Do I need to throw him in his head? Bam! No! And I don't have any more. No way. Two of the last... Okay. So... That's bad, guys. This is bad. I don't know. Maybe I wasted... Yeah, maybe I need to wait for this scene to appear. But basically, he should just drop ink puddles right somewhere. Somewhere here. Hi, how are you? Okay, he's gonna charge again. Bye-bye. So basically, you see, this is the bacon soup can, and it's, I guess, it's all wasted. And uh, this is so sad, actually. Yeah, drop it. Just drop some ink puddles. Thank you. Mr. Boris, dude. Could you please do something? No? Okay, he's still mad at me. Okay, I'm sorry. Now, we need to change this one into a cog. Into, yeah, into this thing, right? Yeah, I don't... He doesn't like bones, so we need... We need a wrench right here. <laughs> anyway, uh, how can I defeat you? I don't know, but... Uh, he's not giving me any ink puddles, which is bad, because we need to put them right here and... Uh, hey, dude. Yeah, just give some to me. I think I glitched something out, because you see... I think I need to throw... Or do I miss... I miss am I missing something right here? I think not. Can I just play play this piano? Oh yeah, uh, one bacon soup. Thank you. And this is this is just a book. Yeah, I'm I'm missing something really big time. Hey, how are you doing? Can you just slap me? 
and give me some bacon soup, please. No? Yeah, he's running at me and uh, I'm confused right here. I'm actually so confused. So maybe I did waste those... Oh yeah! No, no, no! Everything is cool. Now just turn this one and... Uh, do, 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 do. Gimme, 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 gimme! The good stuffage! Yes! Right now, uh, guys, we still need to complete the game. Well, basically, three hits are away and we're gonna do it. Now, boom, boom. You see? He's in... Yes! Ah! Guys, I think I did something wrong. So, oh! That's such a powerful blast. Now, um, basically, I think I threw those bacon soup cans at the worst time possible just because he's invincible right now and I think I should have waited for a few seconds and I, I still uh, wasted two uh, yeah thank you two uh, bacon soup cans uh, by killing butcher gang member and that was not a good option and I, I wasted okay ow now dispose of you thank you wow you're so cool now, let's put this one right here. And I, I wasted, like, I think five uh, bacon soup cans. And I, uh, there was a... I, I could just leave the projectionist alone. That would be that would be even more uh, bacon soup for me. And, uh, wow, you can just go through these bags like a ghost, dude. I like you. Now, he's gonna throw these at me, right? Just throw me. at. Hey, dude, I'm right here. You look creepy whenever you go through these uh, sandbags. Now, okay. Hello. How are you doing this fine evening, sir? <laughs> wow, this is so crazy. Can you just throw them at me and start doing your stuff? Because I think this is gonna be the last time I need to hit him. And wow, it would be so cool if we could finish the game with the bacon soup cans. But, guys, if you want me to try and do so... Ow. He killed me. Guys, anyway, I think this is gonna be like basically the normal ending. I don't know what's gonna happen if we... If it's even possible to try and dispose uh, Mr. Evil uh, Boris the Wolf guy with the bacon soup cans. But if you can, leave a like. If we can get, I don't know, 100 likes, I'm gonna try and do it in the next episode. And right now, I'm just emerging through this amazing butthole. <laughs> and guys, I think it's... It's gonna be the perfect time to end this episode again if you did enjoy it leave a like if you want you are always welcome to subscribe to the channel for more episodes like these and as always guys I'm gonna see you all tomorrow in the next Bendy and the English machine episode. Bye. Bye